So, this is called balancing. This balancing is the most undervalued, underrated skill in badminton, but this is as important as any other skill. Let me show how it is. Welcome back to Star Badminton Academy. This is Chetan. So today we are going to discuss in detail about this skill, how it is important, why it is important. So now let's understand how do you do balancing. Balancing means just from down, racket from down and try to hit little high, not too high like that. Do not hit too high. This is not balancing. This is lifting. If you hit little low, gently only this much from here because you're just balancing so this is how you balance see just balance what you have observed is please observe the shuttle are not going back at all even the if the shuttle is coming faster to me i'm just absorbing the shuttle and just try to balance here so that shuttle will not go behind if it goes behind it looks like this it looks like it's very easy for the opponent if i don't know balancing all beginners intermediates undervalued skill is this because they don't know balancing they will push the shuttle they push. If you know balancing, you just try to balance. See, it's not going back at all. If you can balance here properly, which means you have quite a bit mastered. So, see, let's say I'm serving. I serve, I'm ready. Opponent drops. Shell comes there. From here also, you can balance and make the shuttle go close to the white tape net instead of going just pushing to the service line if you don't know balancing naturally obviously you just push the shuttle so that if you push for the opponent it's very easy to come and pick up and follow the rally here see it's not going back at all you don't want your shuttles to go back but you want your shuttles to go deeper if you want to go shuttle deeper, you have to raise a bit, balance a bit, so that it goes deeper. Thank you for watching the videos. I hope the videos are very, very useful. Thanks for the appreciation. Thanks for the comments. Just do let me know if you want to learn any particular skill, any confusion regarding badminton, we will make a video for that, a dedicated video. Thank you last video I had asked a question the question was how do you generate power where do you generate power or how do you generate power to hit the shuttle from baseline to the baseline or have a hard hit have a hard smash how do you generate the power before answering the question I would like to give you a few example let's assume if I want to throw this shuttle as far as I can, maybe 25, 50 meters longer, let's assume this is the ball. If I want to throw this ball as long as I can, as far as I can, I cannot just throw with this. I cannot just throw like that. It's not going to go. Naturally, what I do, I take the posture. I prepare myself. I pick, pick up that ball or shuttle. I prepare myself. I give everything before that. Watch my posture. I am going to throw. This will work. Having said that, the answer would be, how do you generate the power? You generate the power by having the right kind of a posture. I have a question as usual. So today we learned about the very effective skill, which is most undervalued. 
So we have learned a lot about uh, balancing. So my question to you is, where do you use it? Which means, uh, is it good to use balancing in singles or doubles or mixed doubles? Please answer in the comment section. Thanks for watching the videos. Please subscribe to the channel. Press the bell icon.